welcome back. So in this video, we are going to go about the uh, process of creating all the subfolders uh, for this particular project setup tool. So let's jump back over into mono develop here. And what I want to do first thing is I just want to make sure that the root path was actually created. And you'll notice that this create directory actually returns a directory info type. And this will allow us to check to see if it exists or not. So if it exists, that means it, it created it. So I can create one of these directory info and we'll call this root info is equal to directory dot create directory. All right. So we created it. We refreshed it. Then let's go and say if uh, root info dot exists. All right. Then we can go and do something or we can just check to see if it do if it doesn't exist, then let's just return an exit out of this little program else. Let's go and uh, do another custom method here. So I'm going to put it right around here. We're going to say void create subfolders. All right. And what I want to do is pass in a root. So we'll say string root name or root path. All right. And what I'm going to do is say create subfolders and pass in our root path. Right, because we check to make sure that it got created. So if it's there, then we can go and start putting other folders inside of it. OK, so at this point, what I want to do is create another directory info. And this is going to store the current um, directory that we're on. Right, so inside of Unity, you know, we've got all these directories. And I need to know which folder I'm currently on, basically, as we go through the each of the actual folders in here. So I'm just going to initialize it to null and then I want to create another a list of strings. All right, and we'll call this uh, folder names. And that's just going to be equal to a new empty list. All right, so let's go and actually um, create our first subfolder. So I'm going to say root info equals uh, directory dot create directory and we want to give it a path. So I'm going to give it the current root path, right? Because this current root path is the root of our whole project. All right. So I'm going to say root path. And for this first one, what I want to do is add the art folder. So I'm going to say art. Oops. And we could just put art right there. Cool. So if that actually uh, was created, so we'll say if root info dot exists again. Then we can go and add some other folders inside of it, because what I want to do is add a bunch of child folders to this um, sub folder right here. All right, so let's just see if this is all working so far. OK, so I'm going to save that. We're going to go into Unity over here. All righty. And let's get rid of that shooter folder. We'll use that name again, though. We'll call that shooter. And it didn't actually go and create the subfolder, unfortunately. And I know why. Um, it's actually very simple. Uh, we need to put the asset database refresh after everything. So we refresh it and then close the window. So we'll say uh, create. Uh, subdirectories, give myself some information here. Don't have to do this, but it's good, good habit to get into. All right, so let's go and check that out. So I'm going to keep this open, wait for it to finish compiling. And voila, we now have the art folder underneath it. Okay. So what I need to do is I want to go and create a bunch of folders inside of that. And this is where our list comes into play because I'm going to run another function because I don't want to constantly be doing this over and over and over again or constantly writing out directory dot create directory for all these folders. It's kind of a, a lot of code and really unnecessary. So 
what I'm going to do is a uh, void uh, create folder, like so. And we will give it a string called a path. And we'll say list of strings. We'll say folders. All right. So uh, what I want to do is then say for each uh, string folder, not golder, folder in folders, we want to uh, create a directory. So we're going to say directory dot create directory. And we're going to give it the path, a path plus quotes forward slash. And we'll say folder, right? Because this current, the current string that we're on is the folder name. So that'll create that new folder. So all we need to do is just make sure our folder names is cleared. So we'll say clear. And then let's say folder names dot add. And we'll do animation. So we'll have an animation folder because you always need one of those. We'll have folder names dot add um, objects because we always have objects. Uh, folder names dot add. Uh, materials and we always have prefabs for our, our art so we'll put in our prefabs yeah I mean you could set this up to whatever you want right uh, I'm just trying to show you uh, how this all works so if you see here in the code these are the folders that I have found that I use quite often all right so now what I'm going to do is say create uh, folders and that should actually be called create folder but uh, what I want to do is give it this particular path right here. So this is going to be the path. And we will give it folder names. And that, my friends, should work just fine. Um, to make this a little bit more readable, I'm going to refactor this and just call it get create folders. All right, that'll be way better. All right, so let's test that out. I'm going to go back into Unity here. Say create project structure. And now we have all of our folders underneath. So basically, it's just the process of going through and, you know, setting it up the way that you want. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do is just copy all this stuff here. I don't think you guys want to watch me type that out again. That wouldn't be good. So I just need to make sure I put the correct names in here and we'll give it root path and we'll do folder names like so do the same thing oh I'll leave the scenes out for now because we will want to see how to do that here in a second so I want everything up to resources and again you don't necessarily need to have the resources folder in there you can basically tailor your setup to however uh, you want your particular projects to be set up. So I'll just paste those guys. And I could probably clean this up even more, but you know, it's working pretty, pretty well for now. Um, I don't run in any performance issues. It's a pretty simple script, but uh, I really just wanted to show how I went about doing all this stuff. And that's weird. I didn't actually create the. So we'll say create sub create folders. I see. All right. So we'll give it this path. And you don't really need that guy there, do you? The the plus sign and folder names. Sweet. And that should do that. So let's try it out. All right, so I'm gonna get rid of the previous one, rerun it, and voila. Really cool. All right, so I'm gonna leave you guys there. 
uh, in this particular video. And in the next video, we're going to finish up this tool and just go and have it create some basic scenes for us to start working with. Thanks so much.